going to going to show you how to pull up a pocket filter with the top air frame. So we just slap in all four corners into the frame and form the outer frame for the pocket filter. So it's tight. And put it on top of the assembly table. Then we can begins to put the ribs lock into the coupler position and put in the pocket. You just make sure it's in the center of the frame, center to center for both sides. Then we can begin to put the insert into the center rib. So one, if one side is on, we can have the cramp to hold the position for you, and then fix the other side, and put the media inside the rib, and you can use your finger to slap the insert inside, or roll it, so it's all inserted. Same as for the frame side, we have we have a, a thicker insert that fit into this side. Just make sure the meter meter is inside and lock it with the finger. Then we can put in the small insert. Just separate. Or you can tell. So there's uh, a space. So when it's in position, one pocket is formed. And we can go on for the second rib. Same again, lock into position. Put the pocket filter in whatever method what you want to do just make sure it's not into the center of the clamp both sides as much as you can and put the gear inside the loop Okay, the other side. More easy to use the lower clamp or press. Okay, that's done for both sides. So we can use a different uh, spacer or in small inserts to lock pocket into position. You can see the table is easy to maneuver. So 
when you do it by yourself, you want to uh, move into your best position all the time. First grip. Walk to the center. Either inside the channel of the rib. that's supposed to be very good fit on this side up in this position and the second last three pocket can go in from top or from the bottom whatever space for yourself so you don't have to stretch stretch your arms to do that You can move, uh, stretch a little bit, but uh, with all the spaces in it, will tight. And second half pocket. You can lock one side first and fix it with fit on the first, the, the second side and reposition the first one. Make sure it's fit.
we'll get to put the squeeze inside. Which, uh, it's okay, the last one. Because we can have more space to remove it. all the time, but if you find it tight, you can roll it in, just have it automatically adjust the length. Okay. Okay, it's all in, but uh, forget to put the spacer in between. So I'm going to do it one by one again. Pocket. So you can see this, uh, maybe we have to adjust a little bit more of the uh, size, but it can still fit. Okay. is done. Then we check everything is fit and insert. Now on the other side we slide out the filter. You can see the back filter, the pocket filter is pretty strong and you can stretch it. 